This trailer is our little dog trailer. It's designed for the guy who actually wants to carry a lot of equipment. It could be a dingo contractor, but it could quite easily be any other person who needs to carry a lot of gear. It is six metres long, and it's got the step deck in it, which is only uh, 200 mil step. Not a problem, you can actually put a vehicle on it, which will actually drive up the rear end and drive up on the step and put its nose right up in the front. This trailer is our iTie type trailer. It's a full steel tray with an aluminium floor. Right, the eye tie is all because we can actually tie through the eyes. So you can all of a sudden tie anything down anywhere internally, or you can actually tie externally anywhere along the thing, or through the eyes again. The eye tie trailers and all our eye tie bodies actually have racks internally, so we can actually put ramps inside. We also have a tray, a tool tray. So that's where you keep all your extra straps and all the other junk that you always carry around on a trailer. So this trailer is really set up for the contractor who can just go everywhere and virtually live with all his equipment on the trailer. With a dog trailer, the advantage of a dog trailer is it's like two trailers. So you've got this trailer here, which you've been towing along behind the, the vehicle, and the weight is totally in the middle of here. So that trailer actually just rides along and there's no drawbar weight. So you can actually tow a much heavier trailer and not hurt the vehicle that's towing it. And of course, you need to have room under here so the whole turntable can turn underneath. And that's why we had to go to the step deck, otherwise we would have had to make the whole trailer a little bit taller. And we really wanted to get as low as we could possibly get down there, and we didn't mind having a little bit of height at this point here. Because we can carry vehicles on this trailer, we also provide it with short ramps to put on here. So okay, that gear's in the road there, but if we were putting a trailer on, we use our big ramps at the rear, drive up onto the trailer, then up onto the top deck. These racks are really good because you can put them in any set of holes all the way down the trailer. And in the case of this bigger trailer, we can actually put three or four racks on board. So you can actually carry eight metre lengths of steel on top of the trailer by putting it on three or four racks. Great racks because everything just works as per the tie down system and it changes and you can put it anywhere you like.